Hey guys, this is Drew. And I'm Britt. And we're here with Diverse Suspension Technologies to talk to you about Prothane's universal sway bar bushings. So you need to buy a new sway bar bushing for your vehicle. But before you can do that, you need to know what size sway bar you have. If you get a bushing that's too small, it won't fit over the bar. If you get one that's too large, it won't function properly. Prothane has multiple sizes of sway bar bushings, but we're going to focus today on how to find out what sway bar bushing you need. The best way to measure a sway bar is actually with a digital caliber. We have one here. The first thing you do is you zero it out. And then the next thing you do is you want to find the existing bushing on your bar. And then you're going to measure to the left and right of that bushing. This one measures 22.4 on this side and 22.4 on this side as well. One of the things you have to realize when you measure 22.4 is what bushing do I need, especially if there's not a 22.4 millimeter bushing available. With this particular bushing, we would round down a maximum of half a millimeter. So that would actually give us a 22 uh, millimeter bushing for this bar. Another method you could use with the tool laying around the house is with a crescent wrench and a ruler. You're going to take your wrench and place it over the bar. You're going to tighten it up until it feels snug. Pull it off. Take your ruler and measure the distance between. On this we have about 2.2 centimeters, which is 22 millimeters. If you have a full metric wrench set, you can take each wrench, place it over the bar, and once you find one that fits snug, pull it off. If it says 22 millimeters on the bar, or on the wrench, you have a 22 millimeter bar. Another often overlooked measurement is the bracket size. You'll need to grab the height, the width, and the distance between the two bolts. Once you have that, you can match up your bracket size with Prothane's universal brackets. As you can see here, they're laid out for you on the website. Here we have Prothane's universal sway bar bushing with the greasable bracket. As you can see, there's actually a zerk fitting here at the top of the bracket, which actually channels the grease into the bushing itself which also allows you to fill these reservoirs inside, which keeps the grease on contact with the bar for a long time. And this is their non-greasable design. It doesn't have a zerk fitting, so when you install the bushing, you'll lube it up, and there's actually these small grooves which keep the grease from squirting out once, inst once installing. Another feature that they have that makes installation easy is the split design. Once, when you're installing the sway bar, all you do is pull it over the bar, and it goes on like that. So you don't actually have to take the whole bar off. And it doesn't affect the integrity of the bushing, it just makes installation much simpler. Now that you know what size sway bar you have, you'll need to find the right bushing. You can go to our website, prothanesuspensionparts.com, and find the universal parts link. Then you can select universal sway bar bushings. And here you will find a chart where the bushings are laid out in millimeters first, and in inches on the chart below. You then select your bracket style, greasable or non-greasable, and find the measurement you found on your bar. If you do not find the exact size, round down to the next closest millimeter at a max of half a millimeter. So for the bar that we measured earlier, which was a 22.4 millimeter bar, we would choose the 22 millimeter bushing, and here we have our part number. And if you have any more questions about any of the processes that you've seen here today, you can always shoot us an email or give us a call at our customer service hotline. And as always, I'm Britt. And I'm Drew. We're with Diverse Suspension Technologies. Thanks for checking the video out. You ready? Stop laughing, dude. Come a little closer. You got a shot. Just a tad bit. This one here. Hey guys, this is Drew. And I'm Britt. <laughs> Gosh, you're fluid. <laughs>